Today I got a visit from my grandson, Rayson. And Rayson is new to the land of puppies and rabbits and kitty cats and all that kind of stuff. But babies love animals. So this is a, more about an introduction of introducing babies to animals. So he is fascinated right now with the kitty cat out front. With Alf. So our Doberman is really fascinated with him too. So we're going to introduce each other. Now it's kind of a touchy subject to some people about having a baby around a large dog like a Doberman or a pit bull. And I want to say it's all up to you because you know the characteristics of your dog. But now, if you choose to introduce them and let them interact with each other, that's great. Uh, you know, that they have the right temperament for each other. Now, the thing I'm going to suggest is, especially at this small of a size, that you don't, you don't leave them unaccompanied. Because the dogs, they don't know their size sometimes, and he can accidentally, uh, in a loving way even, hurt the baby, maybe knock him off of something. You know, he's gotten excited and knocked uh, full-grown people to the ground accidentally, like running and bumping into them, not on purpose, not in any kind of mean way, but it can happen. So also, once the child gets a little bigger, even if they get along really great with the animal and everything is fantastic, you still want to monitor them and teach the child safety. Because any dog uh, has their limit to what they're willing to take <laughs> until they want to assert uh, like they would with another animal another pack animal their dominance of hey you can't ride me like a horse you can't sit on top of me and punch me and some parents seem to think it's cute to let that happen but he's trying to get to cruise again but we can't let that happen because we need to teach them respect for the animal and and love and kindness and how things work that you don't push an animal do you baby ain't that right God, he's such a good looking guy. He's beautiful. Say hi, Cruzy. You want to pet the puppies? Yeah. Ah, don't lick him. He don't lick a baby. <laughs> he rode over here where he could see you. Oh, you did so good. He's such a good boy. Let's get him a good treat. Yeah, buddy, two treats. Puppy did good. Yeah. So we had a great visit with Rayson. And uh, he got to interact with him, which I think is great. Now, I'm not putting out there that it's dangerous to have uh, a Doberman Pinscher around a baby. Because I don't believe that. But it's like anything else. He's a large animal. And babies are fragile. And he doesn't necessarily know that as much. He does. He seems to know that. And he takes really kindness and care around the baby. And he did really, really good. And he has this instinct. He seems to be gentle with the baby. But... You know, he is a large animal, and he, he could accidentally cause some harm. Now, I don't think he has a harmful bone in his body on purpose to hurt the baby. But, you know, accidentally, it could happen. So, what I suggest, like I said, is be careful, be watchful, 
uh, until they get at a really good age, 10 or 11 maybe, don't, don't just cut them loose to do whatever they want to do. You know, keep an eye on them and watch them. But he's such a good boy. He wouldn't hurt him on purpose, would you, baby? No. So let me know what you think about whether you think it's uh, appropriate to, to bring babies and large dogs together. And there's a lot of things in the news, you know, about... Uh, about it not ending so well <laughs> so anyway let me know what you think what your thoughts are and the community on this page is what makes it so great on, on my youtube channel is what makes it so great is that we always get a good answer from you guys and we always get some really good help and uh, we've got some really really good commenters in the comment section if you have any comments or you have any questions the comment section is a great place to ask them because these guys are really experienced, way more experienced than me with Dobermans. And uh, they can really help you out. That's my boy right there. Alright guys, thank you very much for watching.